The monastery began in Jamaica Plain, 1961, with only a few fathers who lived in dire poverty for some years. Um, we were renting a couple of apartments across the street from the monastery and had to find a new place. That's when we moved here to this house in 1969. When we moved here, we were already baking the bread that we are now beginning to sell. An Anatolian recipe, Anatolian means Asia Minor. It's traditional and uses a Middle Eastern spice. We give it out at every Easter, Pascha, and Christmas time. And each Christmas and Pascha, we bake around 1,500 loaves uh, to give out. And over the years, people told us we should sell the bread. We've set up a website where it can be ordered directly, and we can either mail it to them or deliver it, or they can come here and pick it up. So it's pretty flexible. The thing is we've got hundreds, perhaps thousands of people already familiar with the bread, and now we have labels on them. They'll see that they can order it for themselves. We don't use preservatives in the bread, so it's best consumed right away, which isn't a problem for most people. <laughs> they uh, uh, will send somebody a loaf and they'll say, well, it arrived home before I got home, and when I got home there wasn't any left. <laughs> It's with sesame seeds sprinkled on the top. It's very tasty, very soft. When it's fresh, it's, there's nothing like it. Uh, you can just eat it as is. It toasts very quickly. Some people put peanut butter on it, which I think is ridiculous, but um, that's, if that's what they want to do with it. <laughs> One of the things we're founded on is almsgiving. In other words, helping out people in need. The Abbot regularly helps a lot of people financially, whether it's for medical needs, lodging, paying their bills, whatever. So we're hoping that selling this bread will help our diocese, which also does this sort of thing, and our monastery.